the St. Kilda Festival. Different stages and venues. Baby, I'm a array of food and drinks. Caramelized onions are my favorite. Exotic food from around the world. And decompress from all of this craziness. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? Welcome back to our channel. Today we're in Melbourne and we're really excited to show you one of the biggest cultural events in Australia, the St. Kilda Festival. An annual event that celebrates music, arts, food and culture. The festival attracts over 400,000 visitors and is one of Melbourne's most iconic events. It's held every February and is an incredible showcase of local talent. Because it's Australia, they supply free high quality sunblock. The festival features live performances from over 60 local bands, buskers and DJs. Spread across a number of different stages and venues. So there's something for everybody. People up the front, wipe to the people up the back. Baby, I'm a freezer, Mona Lisa, damn the world. We say we love, we say we love. We gave it all, we gave it all. We say we love, we say we love. There's an amazing array of food and drinks on offer. From traditional Aussie meat pies. Caramelized onion and lamb shoulder in the oven for six hours. Yes. Wonderful. Enjoy. Thank you. Oh, right here, the crust. And the caramelized onions are my favorite. Oh my God, it's so good. We're going to go back for more. To exotic food from around the world. You want guacamole? Can't resist Mexican food. Fall in love and tear it down as soon as we wake up. Promise you the world tonight. Show me what I've got. Your body speaks my language and you read me like a book. But this night means forever and so does me and you. St. Kilda Festival started in 1980 as a small community event and has grown into one of Melbourne's largest and best attended cultural festivals. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's wonderful. I had a Krishna serve up some mighty fine watermelon. And it's free. Thanks, guys. Quiet zones where you can go in and get a weighted blanket and headphones and decompress from all of this craziness. It gets even crazier at night, but you know, we don't stay out late. All in all, definitely worthwhile to spend the day out here at the St. Kilda Festival. I really think there's a lot for everybody here. And my favorite is the food and people watching. The people watching in Melbourne is always amazing. Melbourne has amazing style from all levels, but the food. Oh, that meat pie. And the live music is amazing also. Anyways, we're off. <laughs> Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>